Are you sure you're ready to go? Yes. Because I uh, have no idea what the fuck is even go- <gasps> There's actually music, finally. Klaus! Ugh. It's a circus. Klaus! 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 Klaus, you're huge! Of course, any doll can be the size of a human in their own haven if they wish. So that's where we are. A haven, so to say. As dolls do not sleep, havens take the place of dreams. It is a place to recollect, also to relax and feel safe from pesky humans. It's beautiful. If I could, I'd live here forever. Would you? Of course not. I was only wishful thinking. It doesn't have to be. If you'd only sign the contract with me, you'd be able to come here whenever you wish. There are other dolls. How cute! At least listen, you rude girl. No. If that's how you wish to act, go and be a monkey. I'll wait here for you when you wish to leave. I'll stay until the dragon leaves. Alright. Hey! It's Mary! I've heard so much about you! Would you like some cotton candy? Of course. I'm sorry, Mr. Claus said, told me not to give it to anybody ever no way no how. Oh. Well, you're a dog. Bark, bark. Just look at the candy. It looks delicious. I hear someone will give you something nice for some candy. Those types of people are dangerous. That's true, Mr. Dog. I'm here to teach you about public safety. A man comes up in a van and says, want some candy? What do you do? Undeo! If they ever attack you or you're in danger, come to me and I'll heal you up. Oh. Well, you're a good dog. Well, that's more reassuring. Bark, bark. Hello! It's Mary! I'm sorry, Miss Mary, but you can't enter. Why not? Mr. Claus said so. He's shy, after all. Is he? He seems pretty blunt and straightforward to me. What's over here? Ah! More circus. Hello, Mary! Don't you get bored of standing there all day? Of course not! I get to see my sister on the other side! I also get to sneak some candy for myself. But don't tell Mr. Claus! If you do, I have to snip out your tongue. Okay, I don't like this one. <laughs> What about you? Hello, Mary. Hello. May I ask you how you all know my name? Mr. Claus has told us. He said a very important human would be passing through here, so he told us to clean up. Did he tell you my name? Nope. Then... Uh, humans can't read a book by its cover. How unfortunate. I don't understand. I'm leaving. Bye. What's over here? Ooh, things. Reviving. Is this... What is this? Like in my head, it's it's a picture of a girl, and this is this is her dress area, and her legs down the bottom of the screen, and her arm is I don't know whatever. I don't know, whatever, whatever. What do you want? <laughs> is, is this a junk carnival worker? I'm surprised Claus has one here. Oh, really, she knows. Me too. A piece of paper on top of the boxes. It's a flyer for an old circus that says, Hot stopping jaw dropping performances! Not recommended for children with bad diseases who might drop dead at any second. What sort of advertising is this? That's a terrible thing to say. It is, but it is thoughtful because you don't want any kids dropping dead in the middle of your performance. It makes you look bad. Work, work. Did you find something good yet? I found a lot of nice things. If you look hard enough and search long enough and investigate more than enough, you'll find a fun rhyme. Like those healing rhymes? Something more fun than that come deep from inside. They can't be open with keys and locks. Collect a lot of them and grow! I don't really understand, but he's so cute. He is, he's a cutie. He's a cutie. Oh, I didn't see you up there. What are you doing? It's Mary. I'm sorry. I don't have anything important to say. Well, okay. I guess I'll go back to clouds. What is this? Do you wish to leave? No. Uh, show me secrets. What sorts of secrets? Um, tell me secrets about you. Something about Claus, I guess. Girls shouldn't ask to see secrets about men in the places where they are most exposed. I feel like I'm missing a huge part of the conversation. Alright, tell me about dolls. Show me secrets about dolls. There isn't much to show. We are the same as you, after all. But that... Though dolls would be able to understand what I'm saying more so than a human would be f fragile ego would. Okay, that, that sentence didn't come out of my mouth right. 
Um, there it is though, if you want to read it again. I somehow knew he was going to say that. Alright, tell me secrets about havens. Oh, so you wish to actually listen. Havens are the safest place for a doll. We can be in whatever form we wish to be seen in. We also gather familiars. They are dolls who are of lesser statue that wish to stay by our sides. Though not all havens and familiars are nice. Take care not to anger any dolls in the future. I will. Okay. Is is the dragon gone? Of course I don't know something like that. Oh, so there's no point in asking. Correct. There, I suppose it is safe now. Good. How, how would you... You just said, how would you... Do you wish to leave now? Just a little bit longer. I see. No, 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 no. This haven is gorgeous, but we're gonna kick some fucking dragon ass. Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's do it. Fight. Kick. Go. Go. Fuck. Wait, is there a save? How do I save? Save. Cool. Sweet. Awesome. Great. Grand. Wonderful. Woohoo! I have to cough. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Hey, Claus. Claus Yaws. Claus Yaws born. Alright, I'm ready, I'm ready to leave. I'm ready to leave. I'm ready to leave. Yes. Who the fuck went into my room? I told you, bitch, to stay out of the fuck out. That's the one. Okay, Claus, didn't you say you'd help? I did. But I'll be of no help to you if you owe me nothing. What? What are the contract terms? It's... The typical flesh to reason, ra raisin, flesh, flesh to reason contract. Flesh to is it, is it resin, raisin? I forget. You give me your flesh in exchange for my raisin. Resin. I don't know. That makes no sense. It's impossible. The only impossibilities are the ones that human put upon themselves. I will say no more. Will you sign it or not? Well. Okay. The verbal contract has been signed. Yes. Yes, it has. When a human is ready, boil it up and exchange shells. Get the fuck away from me! Claus, will you help now? Of course. I shall tear out your eyes and destroy your eardrums. Oh. That's the only true way to get rid of your problem. We dolls just can't erase another human. You didn't say anything like that. You never asked. Did you expect me to grow into the size of a human and tear down the door and cause a ruckus in your honor like some prince? I can't do the impossible, Mary. But you just said... <sighs> you know, Claus, don't, don't know you very much. But you're kind of a prick. But I guess I can't. I signed a contract with my mouth. In words, which, oh, I can't fucking break a verbal contract. That doesn't hold up in the fucking legal standings of the United States of America. Okay, let's fucking go. Hey, what, what if I go out here? Okay, will something happen again? No. Okay. How do I go back? Where's where's the back? Back? Back, back. Okay, there's the back. I guess I will go to... Amanda's shop. Amanda. Amanda, 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 Amanda. Hey. Mary, why are you carrying claws with you? I we already talked about this. We just did yesterday. Okay. What, what is, are you something? It's an old rocking horse. Oh wait, are you something? I just remembered. Now that I have you, perhaps you could take me to the workshop. I don't have the skills to fix you, claws. Fix me? What are you talking about, you monkey? I have nothing need. I have nothing in need of fixing. If I wasn't so salty, then why do you want to enter? It's of no concern to you. Now enter! Okay. Oh, Mary looked like she was- Oh, there's things in here! Claus? Don't bother me right now. I wonder what's wrong with them. I don't know! Claus? I found a healing rhyme! Yay! Yeah, I haven't really had any combat, but I'm stocking up! Yes. Are these notes over here? Dangerous looking tools. It's a really faded picture of... It looks like a young boy. A man and Amanda? Just how old is this picture? The text says, Nicholas is happy fourth birthday. The boy looks familiar. What are you? What are you? This looks like a torn out of a... P 
page, a torn out page from an old book. It says, a good boy is happy and strong. A bad body is sad and sick. I said boy and I meant body. A good body is happy and strong. A bad body is sad and sick. Only good bodies are accepted. Do both stay awake? Huh. Whoever didn't think of the idea first should really just sleep forever. It's their bad luck. I don't really get it. Oh, it looks like Amanda wrote some side notes. That's not the words. You know, you, you know how I don't really read the words exactly? But I just kind of jump and you get the gist of what I'm saying. Yeah, don't judge me. Ministry idiots don't know how to write things clearly. Dolls and humans can switch bodies, but if a body is bad, then I suppose the person who accepted the contract, rather than proposing it, ends up dying? Or is it sleeping? I haven't seen this in action yet, so I don't know exactly. I wonder if dolls think this stuff on their own. It's not as though I... Ugh. It's not as if I gave mine the ability when I created them. A bad body, huh? I wonder what mine would be considered. I don't know. I got a bad body. I do nothing but put junk in it 24-7, so that's terrible. An old book about doll anatomy. It looks well-loved. And quite old. I wonder where she got this from. It must have cost a lot. Yeah, open it. Oh, an old letter fell out. I got a dusty ladder. I got a dusty ladder. Hey, Claude, you ready to go? I'm fine now. We can go. Okay. I think I got all the things here. Wait, what are you? You're like, you're awkward. There are suitcases and more boxes. I can't tell because they aren't colored in. <laughs> Wait, what? These are suitcases? Or maybe boxes? I can't tell because they aren't colored in. You're right. They're not. Can you, can you see what this is? Haha, <laughs> fourth wall. Love it. Hey, I went into your shit. You know, I don't mind you snooping around, but can you at least ask before you enter my back room? I'm sorry, Amanda. Claus wanted... Claus? What did he do? Uh, I'm sorry, it's nothing. <laughs> this dress must be getting to you, Mary. Is everything okay over there? Is it still? I'm fine. Why does she look so angry? Is it because I snooped around? Poor thing, you look so worn and tired. The bag under your eyes have gotten droopier. And you look frumpier? Frump, frumpier. Never heard that word. You look frumpier than usual. Poor, poor Mary. If anything happens, you can tell me. Anything at all. Anything strange or... I'm buying Amanda. Okay. I don't... Never mind. Okay, I'm going. I'm leaving now. Bye. I got things. Yes, return home. Is there more? Or should I just go to my bedroom? I have a dusty letter, maybe... Yep! Klaus? Klaus, 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 what are you doing? What is it? I've been wondering about this letter I found. A letter? That's... Mary, don't open it! Oh, well, I did the thing that you said. And now, ooh! I knew it. What just happened? <gasps> I look lovely! You opened an invitation to a doll haven. And from the look of it, it was rather urgent one as well. I wasn't invited anywhere. Can't we just leave? Humans are barbaric as always. We can't just leave until our business is finished. It's all about manners. Nonetheless, there's no use in standing here. Let's go. But be careful. This door, I mean this haven, isn't exactly a safe place. Uh-oh. Safe space. I need it. Okay, so I have... I have... Oh yeah, I can switch. Claus has an attack, so why would I not do that? What are you? Are you Dougie? Bark, bark. That top hat looks cute. Even though this place belongs to a boy, make sure you look under every nook and cranny. Alright. This dog gives terrible advice. I'm just a dog. He's just a dog. <laughs> <laughs> you know what, Claus? Gaga -ga -ga the sassy, what is that? Thank <laughs> you.